but we bring our, our base malt in from the silo outside, about 50,000 pounds of organic two-row malted barley comes in. That grain gets fed into what we call the recipe tank, and we add into that some other grains that are instrumental in creating either the flavor or the color of the beer. And the hot water then basically activates the enzymes and gets the process going to convert these really complicated carbohydrate chains to simple sugar chains. That happens at a very prescribed temperature, so temperature is a big deal. Uh, plus or minus one or two degrees it will make the difference of a sweeter or drier beer. And that's where the, the beer is sanitized by boiling and we add hops. Hops is critical for bitterness and the hop flavor and hop aroma. Basically it's ready to ferment in the large process tanks. That cool wort that's now been boiled and hopped goes off to fermenter and the yeast are added. And then what's left behind is beer, ready to drink, but it's still not cold, not carbonated. We'll send it over to packaging where it's force carbonated and then packaged on the keg line. 